received word that a major supplier of ammunition has just been bombed by German saboteurs. We will go now go to the recently destroyed Black Tom Island for more information. As if we needed another excuse to hate the Germans. A little over a year after German U-boats destroyed the Lusitania, a British cruise ship holding innocent British and American civilians, Black Tom Island has been bombed. This, this disturbance has been considered as strong as that of an earthquake at 5.5 the Richter scale. Windows and houses 25 miles away have been broken by this explosion. It is believed that this island was bombed by German agents. As many as seven people were killed, including a young child. Hundreds of injuries have been reported. We go to a victim in the hospital now. Hello, sir. Hello. Tell us what happened today at Black Tom Island. Well, I was sleeping, and about one o'clock I saw a bright light, like fire, way out in the distance. So I went outside to see what was going on. Some fire trucks came driving by, heading out to the bridge that leads out to Black Tom Island. I went out to see what was going on, and debris came flying out and hit me in the leg. Oh dear, why aren't you being treated? Someone told me that the Red Cross wouldn't treat me because I'm German-American. Franz Schwartz is German, and I might endanger them. And that's my name. The Committee on Public Information, or CPI, was created by American President Woodrow Wilson to influence American people to be more pro-war. Four Minutemen, as the one shown here, spoke to people for what was judged to be their average attention span. Four minutes, covering all the patriotic things that could be done in times of war. Exactly. This included buying war bonds and planting victory gardens. Unlike many other pro-war agencies of the time, this group tried to stay positive and avoid hymns of hate. They influenced people through films, pictures, radio, and newspapers. Though positive, their stories were often false and later were called the Committee of Public Misinformation. Soon, their focus became more negative, calling the German Kaiser the Hun and depicting him attacking women and children. Shown here is a film about the Hun who is often depicted with a German army helmet and a monster face or a gorilla head. <laughs> My job, madam.
Super Patriot! Help, President Wilson! I need your help! Who is he? In his country, he's called the Kaiser, but here, he's called the Hun. How do we stop him? By buying war bonds. Hello, sir. What would you like to have? I think I'll have the fish with sauerkraut. What did you say? Um, uh, fish with sauerkraut? <laughs> That's liberty cabbage to you! Der Zomber von Oz, that's German! I am a president and my name- <laughs> Hundreds of her injured have been reported. We go to a victim in the hospital now. Sam! <laughs> 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 what are you doing?